Hello and welcome to Pool Museum. I'm Harriet Still and I'm the Hardy's Wessex Curator for Wessex Museums. At the moment this exhibition is showing until the 30th of October at Pool Museum, Salisbury Museum, Dorchester Museum and Wiltshire Museum. If you go up to Galleries 1 and 2, you have the opportunity to see many objects on display for the first time ever from the Thomas Hardy collection. This really is a once in a lifetime experience and if you can go and see it, please do. At Paul Museum, we're looking at the themes of love and war in Hardy's writing. In the first gallery, you can see a picture by John Constable painted in 1816 when he visited on honeymoon with his wife. The scene that he paints is very like the scene depicted by Thomas Hardy in his novel, The Trumpet Major. My favourite objects are the memoirs that were written by his wife the year before she died. Even though their later relationship was quite fraught, these memoirs cast her mind back to Cornwall where they first met. The final object that we have in this exhibition on love are two letters by Thomas Hardy's second wife, one talking about her happiness after their marriage and the second talking about how intolerably lonely she was after his death. One of the most unusual objects that we have in the exhibition is a guillotine carved out of bone by a French prisoner of war during the Napoleonic period. One of the objects that we have on display for the first time here is Thomas Hardy's handwritten notebook for his novel The Trumpet Major. It's set in the Napoleonic period and he's included little sketches of soldiers and teapots and hats. But we also have a children's trail and we've worked with Arts University of Bournemouth to create some immersive and interactive installations which give you a sense of Wessex beyond the walls of this museum. This exhibition really is a once in a lifetime opportunity to see one of the largest collections of Thomas Hardy objects on display at one time across four museums, some of which have never been on public display before. So I really encourage you to go and see it if you possibly can.